Hi there, this is something I said I'd record a couple of weeks ago. I just haven't got around to it. I thought I'd sit down this morning and get this done. In class, we talked about using short vowel sounds and trying to distinguish them clearly from one another. So we came up with this little exercise. We're going to begin by using some short words to make those vowel sounds and just repeat the series over a few times. Cat, get, kit, off, up. Cat, get, kit, off, up. Cat, get, kit, off, up. Repeat that a few times until you've got the hang of those words. And then what we'll do is we'll just strip away the consonants and leave the vowel sounds. A, E, I, O, A. A, E, I, O, A. A, E, I, O, A. Once you've done that a few times, then we're going to add the same consonant sound after each of those vowels. We're going to start with the letter L. Al, L, Il, Ol, Ul. Al, L, Il, Ol, Ul. L, L, Il, Ol, Ol. Now you can continue by adding any consonant sound after those vowel sounds, but particularly for people who have difficulty with the L and the N sound, perhaps the next one you should do is adding N after the vowel. So. An, en, in, on, un. An, en, in, on, un. An, en, in, on, un. Now, if you really want to practice the difference between L and N, alternate them. L, N. L, N. Il, In. Ol, On. Ol, Un. And as you alternate them, just notice the difference in the feeling of your tongue as it makes each of those consonant sounds. So I'll do it again. Al, an, l, n, il, in, ol, on, ul, un. The last thing we did was put a consonant sound before the vowel as well as after. We used the consonant R and the consonant L to follow, but you can use any consonant sounds. Um, I'd suggest you particularly focus on consonant sounds you struggle with. So here's the example we used in class. Rel, rel. Rill, roll, roll. Rell, rell, rill, roll, roll. Rell, rell, rill, roll, roll. 
So I'd encourage you to get a bit creative with your exercises using different consonants to proceed and to follow the short vowel.